Maybe you've been wondering, can I use Thrive Leads together with Active Campaign? Yes, you can. And here's a tutorial to show you exactly how it's done. In your WordPress admin dashboard, you'll see the Thrive options here. And one of the points is API connections. You click that, that brings you to this screen. And from this drop down, you choose Active Campaign. As you can see, we need an API URL and an API key. And to get them, you need to log into your Active Campaign account. In your account, go to this drop down here next to your username and go to My Settings. And in the settings, go to API. And this is exactly where you'll find these two pieces of information. So we copy the first one, just select it, copy it, paste it in here, and then copy the second one, copy that, paste it in here, and then click on the Connect to Active Campaign button. After a few seconds, you should see this success message right here. And in your active connections, you will see active campaign added to the list. Now, when you're editing a Thrive Leads form, you click on the opt-in element and click on connect with service. You create a new connection. You select API and go to the next step. Here from the drop down, you select active campaign. And then this will give you a list of all the lists in active campaign. In my demo case here, my demo account, I only have this one list. And if you want to have multiple lists here, you basically go to your active campaign account and create them there, right? And it will automatically show all the lists in here. So you select the one you want and click on save. And then on this screen, you get to customize the fields that will be shown. Now you have to have an email field that's mandatory, but you can have an optional name field and phone number field. And you simply select or deselect them here. And you have all your usual options like changing the label in the field. Um, you can have validations of the fields. You can make them mandatory, add icons and so on. An important option is here after the form is submitted. So after someone fills it out and clicks the button, you can choose to either keep them on the same page or redirect them to a custom thank you page URL. In most cases, that is what you want to do. So you enter the URL right here and then click on save. This will update the fields in your form. And once you save the changes in the editor, that completes the connection between this form and your active campaign mailing list. When you've set this up, make sure to test everything with, you know, a test account, sign up yourself to make sure the connection works and the lead is added to the correct place in your active campaign account.